So let us look at the difference between black people and white people. We just normally think it's the skin. We do have more melanin in our skin than any other race. However, this melanin is in your bones because you'd have more minerals in your bones than any other race. It causes you to have faster reaction time in your muscle, fast twitch reaction than any other race. It causes you to absorb more flavor in the food than any other race. It causes you to absorb more sound in your ear than any other race. It causes you to absorb more color when you see color than any other race. It causes you to be more psychic, more spiritual, more human. And this is what white people say about us. But then again, We've been miseducated, so we don't know these things. And that's on purpose. It can be in economics, it can be in chemistry, it can be in biology, it can be in history. Whatever education you've received from them is a miseducation. And the worst one has been in biology and chemistry. Totally miseducated us. Because they don't want you to know about this melanin. A lot of us have been to their schools and never even heard this. Some people think melanin has something to do with a new type of watermelon. They don't know what it is, because they've been miseducated. Although we, they, the white folks have a melanin convention every three years. The Ita Italians go, the Germans go, the US go, the French go, but they have never invited anyone black in history. Some of us need more than a wake-up call. Some of us need more than a wake-up call. Some of us always think that something always happens to the other guy. You know, the other guy gets in a car accident. The other guy gets diabetes. The other guy gets fired. Well, today, you're the other guy. All indications are you're the other guy. Diabetes, high blood pressure, hyperactivity, infertility, fibroid tumors, prostate disease, disease. You are the other guy that you think everything happens to. Your body was made by a lawyer, by a scientist. You call this scientist and lawyer God. Yeah, God is a scientist. Put together this thing you call a galaxy, you got to know some science. Look at this. Even the wax in your ear is different from other races. We have more moisture in our ears than any other race. Chinese wax is drier. So I'm saying our hair is different, our ear wax is different, how we see is different, how we hear is different, we taste food differently, we taste the full flavor of food. No other race does that on this planet. Isn't that something? So they don't want you to know these things, but we're gonna know this stuff. We're talking about normal values are set on white people. We can say Caucasians, we can say Europeans, but I'm just talking about basic biology. Now we're talking about the races of humans as classified by white folk. What we're saying is that they rate us the highest on the human scale, they rate us six. And they rate themselves the lowest on the human scale. This is what white folk do for themselves. This is their scale, not mine. Not African centered, this is them. So, what we're saying is black folk have the highest amount of vitamins and minerals in their body of any race. So, when you send your blood to the lab, that's a chemical test. So, since the labs fix the normal value on white folks, when your vitamin and mineral content, which is six, falls all the way down to one, they're going to say there's nothing wrong with you and you're already twice as sick. Isn't that something? Medical racism. You thought it was just in school or housing. No. When you control science, you control everything. The scientists run this planet. Soldiers don't invent bullets, scientists do. So they don't want you to know these things. But we're going to know this stuff.